Dr. Chandler was remembered for how she touched so many people and how she fought hard during her cancer fight. CBS 6 anchor Reba Hollingsworth featured Dr. Chandler in her Buddy Check 6 reports, and over the years, the two became friends. Reba has this special tribute to her friend, Dr. Talisha Chandler. In 2016, I first met Dr. Talisha Chandler for a Buddy Check 6 story. My story's far from over. With God, I'm an overcomer. She was the first lady at Cedar Street Baptist Church. She was affectionately known as Lady C. Of the countless stories I covered, I couldn't forget Talisha's. My right breast just felt thick or just different. It looked different. It felt different. In 2014, Talisha knew something wasn't right. She had mammograms and ultrasounds. All came back negative. In August of 2015, she had an MRI after unbearable back pain. That's when she was diagnosed with stage 4 breast cancer, which had spread to her liver and bones. We believe that nothing happens by accident, but everything happens on purpose. In 2019, Talisha was featured in another Buddy Check 6 report. The day we were supposed to record our 101 interview turned into the Sunday morning sermon. The MRI showed that the cancer had spread to my brain. And through it all, Lady C's faith was unshakable. But God has not failed me. And he answers me every time. Every time I call him, he answers. Being at church and belting out songs gave her the strength she needed. Lady C came from Baltimore to Richmond in 2018 when her husband, Dr. Anthony Chandler, became the pastor at Cedar Street. Her profession was education. She was the administrative dean of the Amelia School with Richmond Public Schools. In a posting last week, Superintendent Jason Cameras wrote, I'm heartbroken to share the news of the passing of Dr. Talisha Chandler, who will be dearly missed. Lady C was a fighter, often sharing her story to encourage others fighting the same battle. In 2019, she was the keynote speaker at the Our Laughter in the Rain event. Cheryl Tankersley nonprofit celebrates breast cancer warriors and survivors. Last year, Lady C was a model for the event's signature fashion show. For me, Talisha became more than a story. She was my friend. One of our most memorable moments happened last October when a small group of us surprised her at church. Our day ended with brunch and an impromptu trip to the outlet mall in Williamsburg. The best part of that day, to see her smile. And Lady C had a way of making a lot of people smile, especially the big loves in her life, her husband, three children, and granddaughter. <laughs> You, you little pretty lady. I mean, I love the sparkles. I, I know I'm addicted. How are you? Hi. One of the books she authored, Sparkling Through Adversity, it was her testimony. Through the diagnoses, the endless treatments, and sick days, she sparkled, and she loved, and so many loved her back.